So this is just a quick video kind of describing bevel technique um, when it comes to skin. So this white piece of paper is representing skin. So essentially when you um, push through the skin with the bevel up, you can see that the skin starts to collect inside the, the, the needle hollow, the tube. So as you go in, if that was skin, like the paper's bending up and away, but if this was skin, it would be going into the inside of the hollow of the needle. So bevel up creates this kind of um, catch, and usually, typically, that skin will uh, end up having to fold, fold under like that as the needle goes through the incision hole. So we oftentimes suggest bevel down, and when you do bevel down, you can see that um, the skin on the top is just following the needle, and the skin on the bottom, due to the angle, is going to just fold down. So there's nothing getting caught inside <clears throat> the needle. So uh, doing it this way, though, as you are um, pushing in, if you are not properly tenting the skin to do this, it can cause the point of the needle, the tip, to dive. Um, and so there's kind of a, you know, you, the ideally you would be holding the skin up and you can control your depth and your angle. But um, if you want to try a modified approach, you can start with bevel up. You get to the point where the skin begins to um, collect. You can see it collecting there now with the paper, and that's what happens. It folds under. Uh, before you get to that point, uh, you essentially, and you have this crescent shape incision, essentially you, you get to that point and you stop. Hopefully the skin is not actually buckled under by that point, but is in fact still up like this. And then you remove and you turn and you re-enter and continue to pocket up to the point if you need to, or if that depth is too much, but then you remove and then slide your device in.